I'm in Union Square in New York City. I'm here to test people's sweet tooth. What do you do if you want the uh, caffeine of coffee but the deliciousness of hot chocolate? Well, my friends, drinking chocolate. That's right. It's got all the health benefits of a dark chocolate and the caffeine of a coffee. But is it good? Let's hit the streets to find out. Uh, guys, are we uh, are we coffee drinkers here? Sure. Yeah, for sure. No. You like hot chocolate? Even better. Yes, I don't. You don't like chocolate? No. Uh, what's your favorite? Milk, dark? Dark, very dark. How uh, how dark do you go? <laughs> I know, right? Did that that came out right? That was totally normal. I love dark chocolate. Really? What's your percentage of 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 cocoa bean? Oh, I like anything above 80. 85? 100% dark. I don't really know the kinds. What do you think when I say drinking chocolate? Um, hot chocolate, I heard of. Right, right exactly. You would think hot chocolate because that's kind of what it is. The only problem is all the sugar, right? What if you want to make a healthier choice? What do you do? I don't know. I, just, I think that's when you come in. That's where I come in. You're right because I'm saying no to diabetes and saying yes to some delicious drinking chocolate. Okay. That's good. That's very nice. Delicious. This is good. Yeah, that's a good chocolate. It's very good. Right. It's too bad we gave you such a small cup, right? Mm, spicy. Yeah, it's a little spicy. Yeah. It's actually it's 70% cocoa. Um, it's got the antioxidants of a dark chocolate, mm. um, but it's actually got less sugar, so it's a healthier choice. And the expert, you went ahead and gave it your seal of approval. Yeah, I did. Bam! Seal of approval. Boom. It's better than coffee. It's very chocolate. <laughs> well, actually, you're in luck because it is better than coffee. Yeah. Because you know what? It, has, it actually has the caffeine um, that coffee has, yeah. um, but it's also, it's got less sugar, so it's, uh, it's got the antioxidants and all the good stuff for you from a dark chocolate. If you, if you had the two, would you choose this drinking chocolate over a regular hot chocolate? I think I would. There's no milk in it, or in no. It's uh, it's a little bit of steamed milk, mm -hmm. um, but it's uh, you know, not even close to the yeah. sugar that uh, that a regular hot chocolate has. So yeah, you can feel like feel a little it. better. And it doesn't, it isn't like gummy like hot chocolate can get. You know, with all the milk. It's a. Uh, is it organic? It is organic as well. Fantastic. Okay, yes. sounds good. Guys, Pamela, it's got her seal of approval. Patrick, you're gonna you, you're gonna pick that over a regular hot chocolate, right? I sure will. So you would pick this over a regular hot chocolate? Yes. There you go. Uh, it's Daniel approved, and he knows his chocolate. Mom, what about you? I think I would pick the less sugary version. Right, maybe let him have some for uh, dinner next time? Yes, maybe. Hi, Daniel, I just got you chocolate for dinner. You owe me big time. If you like the bold flavor of coffee and the deliciousness of hot chocolate without all the sugar, drinking chocolate. You can find it all over New York City. Mm-mm, good.